Hello, and welcome back to The Conversation. We're here today with natural hair extraordinaire, Talia Wajid. She developed the first complete line of natural hair care products nearly 30 years ago. It's hard to believe it's been that long, but it has. Now she's taking the world by storm with her beauty trade show event. It's an annual event that focuses not just on beauty, but also the business of beauty. Mm -hmm. And it's really an empowering experience to get to go and, you know, try your hand at different things. But also there, there are seminars about learning mm -hmm. how to build your own brand in, as an entrepreneur, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Beauty, health, wellness, business, finance. Yes, we cover it all. Why was that important <laughs> for you to uh, extend what you do beyond the store shelves and, and do it in a space? Well, like that. the show is 24 years old, yeah. <laughs> so we're going back to the 90s where people just were not interested in natural hair. Mm -hmm. And so I wanted to create a... Um, just a platform or an arena where people can come and find out more about the benefits of natural hair from a visual standpoint, from seeing people wearing their hair natural, from being able to ask questions about it, from see, um, seeing different kind of products that you can use on natural hair. Uh, there weren't m many products available there, but you can learn that oils work well, you know, moisturizers work well, those uh -huh. kind of things. So it was just what's going to loosen it up, what's going to yes, keep the, define the, the curl, yeah, yeah, yeah loosen yeah, it to make the easier to comb. Yeah. Yeah. All those things. But it quickly morphed into this lifestyle event because when people start looking at, OK, well, I'm 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 going to go natural. I'm going to stop putting chemicals in my hair. They start looking at, well, what am I putting in my body? What am I putting on my skin? Mm -hmm. I need to go natural, it, use natural products. I need to eat better. You yeah. know, I need to look at, you know, how I'm taking care of my health. So it just morphed into this health and wellness, you know, hair, health, wellness and then lifestyle. Right. And, and you, you spend so some time everything. too. Uh, recognizing women mm -hmm. in this industry. Of, oh, yeah. And we should point out of all hairstyles, right? Because we all, at this point, kind of rotate through styles. Yes, we do. Uh, let's talk about just wanting to celebrate other women and why that's a part of this uh, event every spring here in Atlanta. Yeah, it's very important in that we you know, created a space where women can learn how to grow in whatever trade they're doing or mm -hmm. whatever they're doing. And it's just, it's always been important to me because women have helped me. So I want to extend that, you know, now that I'm in the position that I can. Yeah. And I always put that and make that a real important part of everything that I do. And you see that when you come to the show. Yeah. You see how we celebrate women. We celebrate each other. Yeah. And I, it's like thousands mm -hmm. of women coming to this yes. event every yes, it's in April yes. in Atlanta. Mm -hmm. Right. And mm -hmm. so that's got to be exciting to see something that started so small with not as much interest and mm -hmm. taking on such a, a big platform yeah. now. How are you, how does it make you feel to see, you know, with the Crown Act passing in different mm -hmm. states, watching sort of uh, women and little girls now embracing their hair? Because I, we yeah. remember Ooh, when yes. you made sure the girl's hair was pressed, mm -hmm. and, but now they get to, it's like they don't even know that there was once a feeling about wearing your own natural hair. Right. That's true. What's that feel like for you? It's, it's phenomenal because, you know, I just worked so hard to get that message out to people that, you know, this is another way that we can wear our hair because we've always been told that, you know, our hair, when it's curly or natural, it's bad. As soon as the new growth comes in, well, you got to get Those, a relaxer. You got to touch it up. You have, you know, yeah. moms putting relaxers in four-year-olds hair yeah. because it, they, we're just told that your hair must be straight. It must be straight. So my goal was just or to burn make sure Ear. Yeah. I just had a flashback, oh, honey. Ooh, Burning ear, trying to, to press it there. <laughs> <laughs> trying to straighten uh, it You out. know, is it straight yet? You're stomping your feet and crying. You know, just give me five more minutes and then slapping the relax on. <laughs> it's like so. Yeah. I just want people to know that they have a choice. Right. Black women know that there is a choice. And there's and nothing a lot against of time, women who are still wearing their hair straight. Mm -hmm. But it's just that all option. about knowing that you have a choice. So if someone's telling you this is the only thing you can do, and you believe that, and then someone's telling you, no, here's something else that you can do. If you're open to having that information, because with information, you can make the best decision. Right. So if I have this choice or this choice, I can try both and you see which one works all. best for me. Yeah. But we didn't have that. It was only wear your hair like this right. because this is really bad. Walk out this house. Yeah. yeah. So I wanted people to know that wasn't bad. This is another positive option. It's healthier for your hair. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And just the 30 seconds we have left. So okay. many business lessons here too. Yeah. The bottom line for women who are struggling with trying to, you know, do what you did. Mm -hmm. I've got this passion. I've got this dream and taking, turning the nose into a yes. Yeah. We got to just keep asking the questions, asking for help. 
turn into each other so we can work in cooperation. I like say yeah. it one more time. <laughs> so we can work in cooperation. Yes, we can compete and cooperate. Yeah, with each other we're not. Yeah, to we're, be successful. Yeah, yeah, this isn't a competition mm-hmm. anymore. We're all trying yeah, to help each other yeah. out and help each other grow. Yeah, it's lonely at the top. We mm-hmm. need us. Bring everybody up with us. Yes, yes. Yeah. I climb, you climb, <laughs> you climb. I shine, you right, shine. Exactly. I love it, I love it, I love it. All right, coming up, it is time for a hair to take center stage. You ready? Yes, I'm ready. Talia is <laughs> going to show us some natural hairstyles. She says we can all do at the house some bobby pins and some <laughs> twisting around and some good product. It just takes some time, right? Yes, all right, we've got okay. three beautiful models coming up with different styles. Stay with us. 